So recently I got myself a MY09 2008 Subaru Impreza WRX. One thing I've discovered with this, just for reading online, was <clears throat> the navigation unit. We've got GPS. We've got info. Touchscreen. One thing this model doesn't have is um, a reversing camera, which with a little bit of research online, the Impressors didn't come out with them, but the Liberties and Foresters that came out also had the same head unit in it. Now, one thing I did come across was I have audio off. Go down the bottom left hand side here. Should hopefully see a screen similar to this. You go left, right, left, right, left, right. Bam. We're in a diagnostics menu. Doesn't really tell us, well, it's not overly useful. You can test various sensors, make sure they're all working. Reverse sensor, on. Reverse sensor, on. We go back. We've got rear camera, whoop, rear camera setup, which on this model apparently the Impreza didn't come out with them. So hopefully, with a bit of luck and a couple of parts, I'll be able to get a reverse camera finally hooked up onto this machine, which would be reasonably useful. So we've got, yeah, vehicle signal, connection info. Cam rear camera setup and dealer setup, which on this model I'm not sure is blank. But yeah, to get into that once again, once it starts up, go agree, get over to audio, audio off, left, right, left, right, left, right. Nope. Left, right, left, right, left, right. And I've buggered it. Left, right, left, right, left, right. There we go. So yeah, if you've got a Subaru Impreza that doesn't have a re reversing camera but you've got the factory sat-nav, you should be able to get that retrofitted to it. So yeah.